for you guys. I am in Home Goods. This large Buddha is going to be $130. $130. Very, very large. All right. What else do they have around here? Look, more Buddha. Max Studio. Let me pull this one out. It's on a marble base. Okay, that one is different. It's going to be um, $30. $30. I can't get into like this bowl right here, but it's very nice. It is by Tahari, of course. They make really great home decor. I love it so much. Let's see. All right, let's just keep moving. Look at this. Um, this is different. I don't think I've ever seen this here. That is going to be something new. They want five dollars. Did you get that out? Yeah. $30. <laughs> That's $30. Okay, so this is going to be $30. I found a slinky. That's <laughs> $20. And again, it's by Tahari. A look behind it. You pull this out like a knot. Um, let me see if I can get No, it's all wedged in between. I need to move something to get to there. Okay, let me move this book end. Like a motorcycle, so um, thirteen dollars if you're into that. This wire, wire bowl. Let me pull this out. All right. Okay, here we go. And uh, oh, that's kind of interesting. That's gonna be forty dollars. Have no idea who it's by. Max Studio. Okay. Five dollars. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And again, more Max Studio. This is going to be $25. Alright, I found this box. It is velvet. It has a gold snake made in India and it's $15. Had to move everything around just to get to this box that was in the very, very back. Now I gotta put everything back. I think that's the thing about home goods, you know, you have to actually search for something that you really like. Because, <laughs> you know, everything's kind of like behind everything. Um, look at that. It's going to be 25 Oh, look at this mirror. <laughs> kind of reminds you of Beauty and the Beast a little bit, you know, like a little tiny one. $8. Okay, that is really cute and very different. Now, this piece is definitely different. Definitely different and new. I have not seen this here. It is going to be um, $30. I kind of don't know what it is. <laughs> it's just sitting here. So I guess you could use it for whatever. $30. We do have a clear house. I'm going to make a little garden. That's going to be $15. We got a bike. A gold bike on a marble base. And then look at these more funky um, decor. Again, made in India. They want 15. Oh, look at that. Very different. Let me see. Let me move that down. And let's check that price. It is going to be $10. And more Max Studio. That's going to be like a rustic gold. And $30. Just like the silver one. A mirrored star. There's uh, no price on this one at all. I just found that randomly. We do have another knot. It's going to be gold. And look at that. Let's see how much do they want. Um, $10. And look at that one in the back. Let me see. We pull that forward. Oh, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> and they want $15. Okay. Pretty cool. And I'm finding a lot of these. Um... I guess it's going to be like a wall decor. Um, yeah, right? I don't see a price on it. It's a small one. They do have larger ones. How much are those? This one here is uh, 20. 20 for the bigger ones? And then the one that's even bigger is 30. Yeah, this is like stuff for your wall. They're kind of sharp, actually. Yeah. <laughs> They're pretty sharp. This is really cool. It's going to be $17. They do have a smaller one. Oh no. See, when I touch it, I feel like I'm gonna like smash it. Very delicate. 15. 
We've seen these before. These are 20. Let's see what? Oh, I don't think we've seen this one. And I want to say it's going to be by Tahari. Yeah, because Tahari is known to make stuff like this. Oh, it is um, $20. Very nice. Um, it's like a weight. Look at this basket. Oh, no price. Probably at the bottom. I think we've seen some of these before. Again, with the rocks. Yeah, we've seen that. Look at this old-fashioned sewing machine. <laughs> Little cute decor. Oh, that's a box. I didn't know that. Oh, they want 20 $25. That's kind of cool, too. But look at this. That's going to be 30 I don't know what it is. It's just like a decor piece. Is there a hole on top for a candle? Uh -huh. There is? Should be. Yeah. Okay. So it's like uh, put a little candle in there. Uh, that is one. It is very different. How much do they want for the small one? Oh, this is very lightweight. Um, 17 For the small. I feel like this is always going to be here. They have a silver one and that's 15 That is going to be $80. Oh, look at this tray mirrored on top and I want $20 um, 80 for this like table it has a little mirror on top too oh look at that's kind of cool that's gonna be 300 cute side in table $60 um, I found something like this in world market in world market I think one like $150 the 60 for the small one the bigger one is going to be 80 I actually think uh, this shelf is kind of cool looking. It is going to be $130. Like I said before, I like to look at the odd ones. <laughs> and look at this little cart. Oh, it's not a cart. I thought it would have wheels on it. That's kind of different and unique. Uh, let's see. How much do they want? Uh, 50 So $50 give thanks it has a pumpkin in the middle that is gonna be um thirty dollars kind of looks more halloweeny with that um jack-o-lantern pumpkin mm -hmm. like maybe if they had a regular like fall pumpkin just your no face or anything that's, that's kind of cute this gold mirror um it's going to be 80. nicole miller home on clearance they want 55 dollars has like some studying Okay, that's kind of cute. I know a lot of people who love looking in the mirrors. And sometimes in the mirror section in my um, home goods, it's they're all the same. So I try not to show you the same thing. I try. <laughs> but I think sometimes we do end up seeing some of the same. I have not seen this one here. It is going to be $80. So something very different. Um, I see nothing really new. Here in the wall art area, everything looks the same. That is going to be 50 pretty much. We got to explore, you know, put your tax on there. These are kind of interesting. I've seen people paint these too. Um, some people add pink or whatever color they like. Let's see. And that is it for this um, wall decor section. Yeah, this one has really nothing going on. I also see a lot of painting of those dogs too all the time. And then this large piece. The dollars. And I believe there's a new one behind it. Let me move it. Yeah, that's cool. That is 60. Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Pretty neat here. We like the weird stuff. <laughs> like this right here is not my style, but I do show it. Um, yeah, I don't that's gonna be $30. 30 dollars. 30 What's down here that's like full of glitter I think I've seen this one here before too but I try to show a little bit of everything and not just my taste because my taste changing I noticed that's why I haven't really been buying because I plan on moving and then I feel like if I buy what if I don't like it anymore but I like the unique pieces but yeah I see a lot of stuff like this it's like somebody dripped ice <laughs> it looks like I could paint that or a kid you know, get the paint and just stick it on. They want $30. Same over here. But you know, they're different. Everybody's different and everybody likes different items. Look at that. 
That is a pretty neat hair. I cannot find a price for it. I don't even see one at the bottom. Look at that bench. This bench is going to be $130. $130. Um, 300 300 for that little dresser in front of me. Alright, let's just keep moving. Keep moving on. It's kind of cool. Look at these baskets. Uh, some are going to be 20 And look, they have one with the pineapple too. <laughs> That's cute. 400 um, then we have another one. Um, I can't find the price for you, but you know, a little kid fuzzy bench. <laughs> Let's see. I think they're stocking here soon. Is that a dog bed? I don't know, but it's gonna be two hundred. I don't think it is, but they do have dog beds like that. Look at this set of knobs. Oh wow, that's a large set. How many do you get? 12 for $13. I did manage to find a black one with the floral print and they want $130. Relax denim pillow, they want $20. We have some more pillows, you know, kind of like the floral pattern. Kind of neat and different. Let's see. We're always going to find this here in Home Goods, TJ Maxx, and, um, Marshalls. Oh, look, we have another relax, but in the white. Okay. I found some pasta. Look, we have princess pasta. <laughs> that is funny and different. Oh my gosh, you know what this reminds me of? I just watched a trailer for the new Housewives of New Jersey. And yeah, I watched that stuff. Okay, that's my relaxing time. And there was a mom playing basketball in the trailer and they had a daughter and the daughter said girls don't play basketball and the daughter said i'm over here trying to be a princess i was like oh <laughs> like she was a princess. little girl she was a little girl <laughs> got the halloween pasta i thought that was funny girls don't play basketball oh look they got pirate oh my gosh they got pasta for everybody. If you have a picky eater, this might work for them. And cheerleading, really? Cheerleading pasta? <laughs> My gosh, I remember the cheerleading days. I used to be a cheerleader. The pasta was bad. <laughs> <laughs> and look, we got a gobble gobble. You know, turkey pasta. Oh, look at that. I love pasta, actually. Apple orchard pasta. That is so cool and different. Is that a noodle tree? Very different. Look, here's a football one too. Tailgate and celebrate pasta. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is crazy. But yes, pasta, I want to say, is my weakness. My weakness. I just love it. You know, I just can't picture a bunch of dudes tailgating eating pasta. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you never know. We got gummy orange slices. Okay. Gummy tree frogs, Paris lollipops, no sugar added. We got organic pops. I have those at home, and I don't think anybody's eating those. <laughs> and then we have the cotton candy. Look at that big bag of gummy bears. Oh my gosh, I love gummy bears, you guys, but it has gelatin in there, and I try not to eat that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I kind of think these candies are kind of nasty, but my grandma always has them. <laughs> Those are the strawberry all, one. <laughs> what do you have? Ginger beer? All right. Oh, cock and bull ginger beer is pretty good. But yeah, it's good. Brand, I don't know what brand that is. Rose lemonade and ginger beer again. Lemonade. All right, they got some interesting so things going think on. Think of it like a creamy ginger ale, mm -hmm. but it's got a little more bite to it. That's, oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Oh, mocktails. <laughs> Sparkling pomegranate. All right. What is this one? Ginger and lemongrass. 
All right, you guys, I am going to end this walkthrough here in Home Goods. Thank you so much for watching my videos, following me around the store. <laughs> um, some stores are kind of tricky because um, there's a lot of stores I want to go to, but some of them do not like filming, and I do have to play a lot of music because, um, you know, YouTube picks up the store music, yeah. and sometimes it can be very, very loud. <laughs> yes. um, standing under speakers a lot. And you know what? Big Lot is pretty loud. Burlington. Thank you so much, you guys. I hope all of you have a great day or night. What is that? A heart? Looks like a heart. $7. I don't think I've seen that one. Oh, look at this bowl. That one's pretty cool. Let me, can I pull it out? Oh, yeah, I got it. Look at that. It is um $8, really. That's really cheap. Look at that skull set right there. All right here, cool. the shot glass set. All right, you guys, that is it. Thank you so much, and I will see all of you in the next video. I still like that cake. I like that. I know, me too. I wouldn't call it candy dish. I mean, you put, like, cake in there, like a layered cake. Like, friends. You know, Rachel's trifle? <laughs> Oh yeah, the shepherd pie tray. Yeah, shepherd pie, whatever she made. <laughs> Fifteen. We've seen these before.